According to husband, father, teacher, and author John Stevens, downloading and printing a worksheet to help our child practice math facts is easy. The bigger challenge and bigger reward is creating or seizing existing moments to initiate an impromptu activity or conversation with your child centered on math. We could not agree more. The goal of our face-to-face -face workshops, virtual sessions, and University of Family Learning online videos are to emphasize natural, authentic, and meaningful family learning opportunities. Let's start by listening to a mother share her personal reflection after participating in one of our University of Family Learning mathematics workshops at her child's school, Clyde C. Cox Elementary School. Hello, well, I just moved here from California and this was my first um, workshop. I really enjoyed it and I share with you that before I used to hate math because I did, but now I understand um, how everything has a base and I didn't know that this was part of it and me learning on it, it kind of opened my mind and I feel much released because I feel that now I'm gonna be able to help my children because I would get stressed. And I think unconsciously, I would stress my children. And this workshop um, has given me like an inner peace that I can do it now. So thank you so much. I really enjoy it. It was awesome. And I really love the, the teacher. She was awesome too. We love to hear transformational and life-changing stories from parents. A parent's feelings towards their past experiences can impact the achievement of their children. We hope that the tips and resources outlined in the Mathematics Matters for Families handout will be beneficial for you too. We have worked with thousands of parents and caregivers all over the district, and one comment is the same. I wish I would have learned mathematics this way when I was a child. Hi, good morning. My name is Jessica. My son attends Ira J. Earl Elementary School. And today I have attended uh, FACES Building Base 10 activity that they had here. And I was personally telling them how intrigued I was with the way that we are teaching our students now as far as how to do math. It would have been so much more helpful when I was growing up. You may be thinking, how can I help my child at home? Where do I begin? Where can I fit math in my family's daily routines? You are not alone. Listen to one more quick testimonial from a mother who attended one of our mathematics workshops for preschool families. Hi, I'm Crystal Bartucci. I just attended the DOTS class through FACES here at uh, Nate Mac Elementary School. Um, I came here with my four-year-old daughter and I, I'm not good at coming up with things to do uh, to get my kids thinking about math. Uh, I really do need these worksheets that I can keep in my car to remind me as the day goes on to point out different shapes and to count all the things that we're doing throughout the day, counting groceries, counting apples. Um, so this just helps me. There are easy ways that I can um, work with my child kind of while I'm doing life. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did she just say that we gave her worksheets? Don't get confused by our message today or the starter templates we may provide to get the ideas pumping. In our Mathematics Matters for Families handout, we give you many tips and ideas to authentically experience mathematics and start natural mathematical conversations with your children. Today, we're gonna take a look at how you can elevate the meaningful activities you are already doing, like reading, shopping, cooking, and playing games. Math shapes the world around us in fascinating ways. The PBS Kids for Parents page shows us that math is more than just counting or adding or memorizing math facts. When parents help kids explore everyday math at home, at the store, in the park, and at play, we help our children begin to think like creative, curious mathematicians. An easy daily online resource for busy parents is the Bedtime Math app or website. Every day, they serve up a quick bite of wacky math for multiple ages. It makes mathematics part of the family routine and sparks conversation. Whether it's flamingos, ninjas, pillow forts, children can see mathematics in their favorite topics. No logins, no drilling, no scores, it takes only five minutes a day. 
parents and caregivers can sign up for free by email, on their website, and on the app. Apps and websites are fantastic resources for gathering meaningful skill-based activities and to help with consistent daily practice. But don't underestimate the immeasurable value of reading aloud and talking about stories found in books. Have you ever noticed how picture books have mathematics cleverly mixed throughout the story? Our guide has dozens of suggestions arranged by topic. You can find these books and many more at your school or neighborhood library. Search and ask your librarian for new recommendations. Allow your children to read trade books, sports magazines, newspapers, and children's books to spark family conversations and inspire all ages of learners to pursue mathematics. Track or graph the scores of your favorite sports team. Use the data to look for patterns and make predictions. Are you into do-it-yourself projects and DIY television shows? Would you like to or need to build something of your own? This is the perfect opportunity to grab a how-to book, follow project directions, and experience purposeful math. Making and measuring things are authentic life skills and natural family learning activities. Plan meals and snacks side by side with your children. Find recipes by searching together, choose a dish to make, and create a shopping list. Ask your child to estimate the total cost of the meal or dish and discuss a budget. While you are shopping, compare prices and discuss payment options. Helping your children learn to make appropriate calculations, comparisons, and estimations will help them see how numbers are used in everyday life. Don't forget to have your younger children count the items you purchase and compare the sizes of objects. Be on the lookout for natural counting opportunities and numbers in the environment. Experimenting and experiencing success and failure are the best teachers. Our brains stretch and grow when we self-reflect and learn from the mistakes we make. Kitchens are the perfect place to witness this growth. You and your child could talk about counting versus measuring. Have your child measure ingredients for a recipe you are making. To practice fractions, have, double, or triple a favorite family recipe. Maybe it doesn't turn out perfectly the first time. Too much salt? Did you stir the dough too much? Did you forget to set the timer? Did you forget an ingredient? That's okay. Don't give up. Persevere. Keep learning new foods to make and then enjoy the delicious results. Have your children write down what they learned from the experience and also the family's feedback. Our brains remember best that way. By the way, don't forget to listen to your children count the cups, plates, napkins, knives, forks, and spoons as they set and clear the table. All of these little chats and activities give your children a new lens through which to view the world. The lens of quantity. Many families play games after dinner the screen-free hour before bedtime, while driving in the car, or they even establish a weekly game night. Some families also have traditions of playing dominoes, board games, Sudoku, card games, or games with dice. The list of gaming opportunities is endless. These are natural, authentic, and truly meaningful learning opportunities for your children. A time to share cultural games, family stories, laugh, and have good old-fashioned family fun linked to learning. There is no app that can replace the value of one-on-one -on -one time spent with a loved one. Children savor the minutes of undivided attention, and a lifetime of memories are made while playing the previously mentioned games. Technology can support this time in a competitive way. Archademics is a free website that combines the excitement of video games with educational content to promote learning through exciting, 
focused repetition that enables automaticity and math fluency to be achieved quickly. Immediate corrective feedback facilitates improvement in performance. Users can quickly see mistakes and how to correct them. We challenge you to look for ways to add these activities, modify them to fit your family, and also create some of your own. We hope that this final video from our series of Mathematics Matters for Families was beneficial for parents, guardians, and caregivers. You can see how naturally and spontaneously parents can initiate mathematics and impactful conversations with common materials in the kitchen, on bookshelves, while playing games as a family.